Hi, I'm Bernie Thompson. I'm the founder of Pluggable Technologies. So today we launched our Thunderbolt 3 product line and we're really excited about it. We wanted to show you here on announce day a prototype of the docking station and what's possible with Thunderbolt 3. So we've got a laptop here and this is the Dell uh, XPS 13, the new model that has support for Thunderbolt 3. It uh, launched in fall 2015. Uh, it's one of the earliest models, but over the next few months, there's going to be laptop models and tablets from really a whole range of Windows device makers. So Thunderbolt 3 is an interesting technology. It uh, originates out of Intel. Um, it is a 40 gigabit per second theoretical maximum bus, which is a lot of throughput. Uh, USB 3.1 Gen 2 is a quarter of that. It's only 10 gigabit per second. What's fascinating, though, is that that difference, that 4x difference in performance between USB 3.1 and Thunderbolt 3, they both use the same cable, the USB Type-C cable, and literally the same physical cables will work between the two. Uh, it's just that Thunderbolt 3 cables hit a higher quality level because any um, sort of interference or, uh, or issues with soldering or issues with material will cause uh, the, those uh, high uh, high frequency signals and high throughput uh, traffic to break down. But there's a lot involved with Thunderbolt 3, so we wanted to try to walk through, first of all, some of the functionality that you get. So we're really getting 100% uh, you know, of the performance and very little latency so that this is good for video, it's good for gaming. There's really uh, no, no kind of performance downside to connecting monitors through Thunderbolt 3 this way. The docks that we announced today, this is exactly uh, that dock configuration. We're actually able to connect two monitors up. The dock has a dedicated DisplayPort++ port, uh, and then also the dock has two USB-C ports that are Thunderbolt 3 capable, and one of them, either one, goes back to the laptop, and then the remaining one can be used to daisy-chain to additional Thunderbolt 3 devices, or in this case, connect directly to a monitor via an adapter. So that's how we have this hooked up. We have the, the uh, DisplayPort++ port, is going to this monitor, and then the other downstream Thunderbolt 3 port is going to this monitor. Okay, so we talked about the graphics ports, we talked about uh, the power port here. Basically just have then a, a bunch of additional devices allowing you to connect uh, all the other peripherals that you have. I've got a mouse here connected back to this USB 3 port on the back. Of course the USB 3 ports are backward compatible. So there's two of those USB 3 ports, uh, a gigabit ethernet port, on the front here, we have another USB 3 port and then both a microphone uh, and an audio out jack. Okay, so I showed you connecting the two displays via the docking station. Well, uh, in addition to this kind of docking station format where you've got a lot of peripherals, you've got potentially charging, if you're just interested in getting extra monitors, part of what we announced today at Pluggable uh, are dedicated graphics adapters that are Thunderbolt 3. So you basically have two video outputs connecting to Thunderbolt 3. And so really what uh, these uh, graphics adapters are is the same uh, Intel chipset that's driving this docking station is driving these two graphics outputs and it just gets rid of all the extra ports and reduces the cost significantly. So these dual head graphics adapters will be approximately half the cost of the full docking station and yet they'll have all the same functionality from a graphics perspective. So that's a little bit on Thunderbolt 3. I uh, hope you found that informative, and we've got a lot more information on the Pluggable site. If you go to pluggable.com slash tbt3, we'll kind of collect all of our Thunderbolt 3 information there and provide links out to more information. So I hope you found this informative, and if you have any questions at all, feel free to ask below. Uh, we'll try to answer the best we can. And thanks for going out of your way for pluggable products.